now someone else from the uh, Design for Sustainability group, and it's Uri Pascal. He will be number 33. Thank you very much. Actually, I want to say too many things in too little time, and let's see if we manage. I would like to tell you what is the current situation of eco-design, what is eco-design today, and where is it going. Well, the good news are that eco-design is out there, companies are doing that, and they are looking for greener products. But sustainability is not just about the way we produce products, we know how to do that. It's also about the way consumers are spending money, and how we consume products. In that sense, from a design perspective, Ecodesign is helping us uh, to, to face these issues. And we've been doing that in the last years, mainly from a technical perspective. But Ecodesign is much more than technicalities. Ecodesign is happening in companies and it's about managerial issues. And we see that companies are struggling because they have different ways to do that. So, where are we? Once the low hanging fruit has been picked, Traditional eco-design can contribute little to further development of the discipline. We have communication issues in companies, we also have value-related issues. What kind of fish are we catching? What are we getting out of doing eco-design? Is it contributing to value creation of the company and to reduce environmental load, really? Or what is the best design option for my product portfolio? To answer these questions, we have to realize that there is a bigger picture and eco-design is not alone in this game. Uh, we have to take into account the demand side and how consumers are spending money. This is a key element. Market segmentation requires product differentiation and this applies also to eco-design. So we are going to do it with a fantastic eco-efficiency index uh, that we developed here called EcoValue. Actually, EcoValue is asking for the reduction of environmental load per uh, monetary unit and it helps managers to make decisions based in facts rather than assumptions. They help them to set up priorities and is taking an action-oriented approach. So thank you very much. If you want to know more, you can send me an email. There's no poster. So